It's now time for Check Me Out, our weekly showcase of Nigerians achieving amazing things around the world. This week, we we'll bring you the story of Sadiq Ajibola Williams, a trained architect, project manager, and a martial artist who combines these multidisciplines to create amazing works of art. In some schools of thought will tell you it takes 20 years to achieve a certain type of greatness, especially if you're doing something that other people can't perceive or conceive of. Keep going, you'll find your soul tribe. They will come, you will meet them, they will meet you. Hi, my name is Sadiq Ajibola Williams. I'm a multidisciplinary artist and I use the variants of architecture, dance, film, poetry, music, and martial arts. Check me out. Born in London, 1981, and moved back to Lagos, I think I was about five years old. My mom said I was pronouncing Yoruba words with an English accent, so this boy had to come back home and get culturally inclined and rooted. So when I turned 16, it was time to go to the UK uh, for A-levels um, and back to London life, I guess. Um, and it's just that was just something that had been set in stone from when we were younger. Being a Nigerian in that environment sometimes could be tense, sometimes. Um, sometimes you want to escape um, and sort of like be something else or somewhere else. Well, for me, I was always proud to be Nigerian anyways. So the first degree was um, Bachelor of Arts, BA on Architecture and Design. Kingston University, sorry upon things. A lot of people think architecture is just about drawing lines, but it's not. It's deeply, <coughs> it's a layered coursework, like coursework, like from theoretics to your portfolio, the work you have to do. So there's a huge amount of discipline you have to have to actually even be successful in architectural school. Every time I would draw, there's just something soothing about art, like, I don't know how to explain it. There's this space that it takes me into where I just feel at one with myself. And I only get that feeling when I'm drawing, I'm dancing, or I'm doing martial arts. My job as a spokesperson through using multidisciplinary artistry, whichever variant I pick, I will express certain things through that, through that mode or that system or that style. It's all about expression. Nothing is ever wasted in the school of thought we come from. Everything is everything. Coincidentally, through going through this journey again or re-emerging as an artist or a multidisciplinary artist, I'm now moving my art, my energy back into the architecture space, oddly enough, which is very interesting for me. My name is Sadiq Ajibola Williams. I'm a multidisciplinary artist and you just checked me out. Amazing work, Sadiq. Let's now take a quick reminder of our top story today. Cases of discrimination of people affected by coronavirus are allegedly on the rise as the Nigeria Center for Disease Control warns that stigmatization could hinder efforts to stop the spread of the virus. We want to hear your views, so join the conversation right now on Twitter at Just Nigeria TV. And for more on any of our stories, visit bbc.com forward slash Africa and channelcv.com. And that's where we draw the curtains on the program today. Thank you for staying with us. Until next time, I'm Ajakel Hulotze. Goodbye. <laughs>